for our bed, though. Is the hair over there? see you finding that deviant was far from easy you showed great skill in your investigation but you knew deviants could be unstable you should have been more cautious I thought I could make it talk it was a judgment error never mind I'm sure you'll be more careful in the future The interrogation seemed challenging. What did you think of the Deviant? Um. It simulated human emotion, fear in particular, in a very convincing way. It seemed completely overwhelmed by them and behaved irrationally. This Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the Deviancy case. What do you make of him? Uh. Sure. He's obviously not what I was expecting, but I don't have enough information yet to form a definitive opinion. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. What do you think is the best approach? Um, I guess adapt? I will adapt to his personality. It is in the best interest of the investigation that I avoid conflict and try to accommodate his psychology. She didn't like that. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You can count on me, Amanda. Hurry, Connor. There's little time. Can I help you? I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yes. Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. This would have been hard. Come on, check. Excuse me. 
Do you know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. If we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. Thanks. Now we gotta see the way for. Hey, Lieutenant, do not like androids, man. Detroit basketball. Some donuts. Coffee cup. Japanese maple. What else we got? What else we got? Uh... Oh, he got a dog. Wow, oh, okay. He don't look like he got a dog. Rare ice tag task tax force. Oh that's we got. Oh that's it. Oh that's it. That's it. That's it. That's all we got. It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. Oh, Jesus. Hank! In my office. Oh Hank. I've got 10 new cases involving androids on my desk every day. We've always had isolated incidents. Old ladies losing their android maids and that kind of crap. But now, we're getting reports of assaults and even homicide, like that guy last night. This isn't just CyberLife's problem anymore. It's now Nobody a wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold in the bag. CyberLife sent over this android to help with the investigation. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. No fucking way. I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. Hank, you are seriously starting to piss me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that, so I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. This conversation is over. Jeffrey, Jesus Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. Why are you doing this to me? Listen, I've had just about enough of your bitch. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. Hank can't stand him, man. God. Now, watch us, watch us go and butt in. Let's see. I wonder whether Lieutenant Anderson is really the best person for this investigation. Hey, I don't need a machine to tell me how to handle my men, okay? So get the fuck out of my office. Have a nice day, Captain. Uh. Well, that didn't work so well. Try to talk to the captain.
Okay, that's. All right, let's see what Hank got to say. Understand. I get the impression my presence causes you some inconvenience, Lieutenant. I'd like you to know I'm very sorry about that. Now that we're partners, it would be great to get to know each other better. In any case, I'd like you to know I'm very happy to be working with you. I'm sure we'll make a great team. Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. Huh? Look, I saw a desk now, boy. dog hairs on your chair. I like dogs. What's your dog's name? What's it to you? Sumo. I call him Sumo. Uh, I do basketball. You're a Detroit Gears fan, right? Denton Carter scored 53% of his shots from the three-point line yesterday. Did you see the game? That's what I was watching at the bar last night. Oh. Mess that up. I do the anti -androids. A lot of people don't appreciate having androids around. I was wondering, is there any reason in particular you despise me? Yeah. There is one. About me. Do you listen to Knights of the Black Death? I really like that music. It's full of energy. You listen to heavy metal? Well, I don't really listen to music as such, but I'd like to. <laughs> I guess we start working, man. If you have any files on Deviants, I'd like to take a look at them. Terminal's on your desk. Knock yourself out. Two hundred and forty three files. Take a look first dates here. back nine months. Lab report says it all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. We could follow up on one of these cases. See if we could figure out what happened. That might be a good way to start the investigation. What do you think? He wasn't doing his job. Oh my god. understand you're facing personal issues, Lieutenant. But you need to move past them, and... Hey, don't talk to me like you know me. I'm not your friend, and I don't need your advice, okay? Oh, my God, he's making it so hard. Lieutenant Anderson making it so hard, man. I suggest you sort out your personal issues and let me work with someone more competent. Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. But things are gonna get nasty. Where are you going? Lunch. Bullshit makes me hungry. <laughs> Lieutenant Anderson making it so hard to 
Oh my god, man. Couldn't do nothing that time, man. For some more Detroit Become Human, give this video a big thumbs up, guys. We almost, I don't know how far we is, but we going to get through this walkthrough of this game. It is it's so good. I do not, I like every second of it. But guys, give this video a big thumbs up, and I'll see you on the next one.